Good morning, my name is Jamie. Welcome to Border Bananas. Today we are thrifting at my favorite Goodwill. It's been a couple of weeks since I've been here. I've taken a little break from thrifting, um, so I am back at it again today and excited to be here. Uh, there's some pretty amazing things at Goodwill today. So there's a picture that they just took off the shelves that she's digging out for me so I could look at. <laughs> okay, so here is the picture. It does have a crack right there and a chip, but I don't care. I think it is gorgeous. Look at that. I don't know the maker or anything, but isn't that beautiful? The back looks like this. Very cool. If you are new to my channel, I thrift for myself. At one point in time, I did have an Etsy shop and I was selling on Etsy, but I no longer do that. So I am only thrifting for my own home. And every once in a while, I'll find an item or two for a friend or so. Um, so I don't buy a ton of vintage items. I love vintage items. I love finding vintage items. I love hunting for vintage items but I don't buy a lot of items. I only buy what I can bring into my home and what I have a place for. So if you like thrift with me videos, I would appreciate it if you would give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Check these out, these are super good dupes. It's actually melamine, but it looks like old ironstone. <laughs> There's a bunch of them here. Melamine, melamine. How do you guys say it? Oh, what is this? Made in China dishwasher. There's a green striped bowl. So pretty. Hmm. Gibson. There's a bunch of those here best place to come to outfit your college kids or your kids getting their first apartment <gasps> look at all the bone dishes wow dollar 99 each two three four five six of them see anything good up here They're so heavy, they match the dishes that are just up top. And they are, I don't know, home and garden of some sort. Looks like Corral back there. Yep. Oh, I wish I. Duris? Duff, doofus? O4? <laughs> Those are pretty. Those are super pretty. Uh, Lillian Vernon.
Oh, that's kind of cool. 1999 though? <laughs> I don't think so. cool though. Looks like it's missing a lid of some sort. I like that though. Okay, so is that painted? That looks like it's definitely painted, right? This Francoma piece was a good find. I have had luck selling it online in the past, but I don't sell anymore and it's not my style, so I left it behind. I loved this piece so much. I did push this around in my cart for a little while, but did decide against it. Uh, I thought it would be perfect for a spring decor on my hutch or on my table as a candy dish or something like that. But um, I do have to think about my budget. I was thinking about bringing this cake pan home as well. But I, because my daughter had cracked my last little one that I brought home. I think this is 8 by 12 But I couldn't remember if I replaced it already or not, so I did leave it at the store. Is that the real deal? I have never found that before. The Johnson Brothers, how many are there? There are three. Wow, very cool. There's only three. If there was more, I'd grab the stack for my spring decor. But...
Look at this bear. Is that a piggy bank? <gasps> nope, it's not. Oh my gosh, but that is so cool. $4.99. I don't see a marking anywhere. He is amazing though. Do you guys see a marking? Sometimes you guys catch them after I, when I don't. <laughs> oh, Jamie, gotta be careful. All right, let's look at this little milk glass piece. Is this milk glass? No, this is not milk glass, but it's adorable. Oh, look, a little laying down deer. That is adorable. See this little guy, he's cute too. He's got a honey pot. <gasps> he's adorable. That's made in Taiwan. This Santa's kind of cool. He looks like he was supposed to be holding something, right? <laughs> I want to know what the maker is of this. It's a nicer one, but do I need the tray? Let's see. It says it's made for Pyrex brand 231 Corningware, New York. It has the cork bottom with leather handles. Oh, it goes on the soap here. I see.
Look at this adorable little stool. Wouldn't that be cute as a plant stand? It's really sturdy too. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. Goodwill was moving all of its Christmas and putting it onto one shelf, just condensing it down uh, so it's easier um, after Christmas to uh, find the Christmas uh, to, you know, move uh, back to next year's stock because my, my Goodwill doesn't usually uh, get rid of their Christmas. They just move it into the next year's stock. <laughs> This vintage tray was absolutely gorgeous. I thought it'd be such a cute cookie plate for Santa. Aw, I loved it so much. Activity is really pretty. Home co, of course. <laughs> Santa candle. Oh, he's missing a foot. $3.99. That's beautiful. Actual stained glass. Oh, looks like there's a few back here. Oh, wow. There's a star. $3.99. This is beautiful. $3.99. Too bad I just don't decorate with... Stained glass. Look at this. Isn't that cool? It's plastic. Uh oh, there's a tree over here that's falling. Oh my gosh, I, rem I think my mom had these when I was little. Oh, look at the pretty box. That is really pretty. The 
They were originally $2.99 and now they're $4.99 in Goodwill. I don't know what these are. They look like bobbin spools of some sort and they don't have a price tag on them. So I will ask. They're the only two I see. Huh. I'm recording a video for YouTube. <laughs> there was an older gentleman that I kept bumping into into the store and not like literally, but we just kept um, running into each other and he kept telling me these wonderful stories about um, where he's been during the wars and whatnot and it was really a pleasure talking to him. Oh, wow. somebody did such a nice job on that. This tree has doves on it. Sakura, China. For Bed Bath & Beyond. I see these guys a lot. But there's something up here. Oh, this is cute. One of those candle holders. Oh, gosh. Come on. There we go. Adorable. How much is that guy? $14.99. Party light. Well, that's a neat star. Plastic. I don't know where they're from. Here's more of those pyramid lights. $2.99. Uh oh, I'm dropping elves. There's a vintage Santa something or other.
yell at me, guys, if you see something fancy. Only fancy things, though. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Whoa, look at that candle. Holy smokes. I really liked this blanket a whole lot. I just don't want to store another Christmas specific blanket um, unless it's like a fair bolt blanket, you know. At the ginormous drafting table, holy smokes, that thing is huge. $99. Anybody want to draw some house plans? <laughs> These may be crib sheets. So pretty. There's two of them here. They're tiny. They've got to be crib sheets. So cute though. Here is a nice solid wood buffet to bottom. $9.99 for this. Recollections by Lexington. It's a nice piece. It definitely needs some work. Ooh, that one's gonna fall right out. Nice piece though. And this one's $59.99, the matching piece. That's really cool. I love that. Oh my gosh, you guys. Could you imagine it all made over? sanded down to raw wood so it's not so orange not too bad kind of loving the frame on this pretty So these buckets are actually, oh my gosh, $8.99 is a really good price for this. I paid $30 for my bucket like eight years ago. Um, and then I just put it in, I sanded it down in a bunch of spots and then did the Lysol toilet bowl cleaner trick on it to make it look old and it works so good. But that is such a good price for that. $8.99, be great for container gardens too. Oh my goodness, look at him.
loved finding this package of vintage wrapping paper. Look how pretty it is. Oh, I thought it was so cute. I'm on my second pass now and I really like this shape and style of this basket but it's really really orange and it's too orange for my taste. And there was this really sweet young woman working as I was looking in this bin and she's asking me if I found anything good and she told me that I should go over and look at the ones that she's just pulling out. So I did because she said there might be good ones in here and there was, there was some vintage trucks. You'll see those in just a minute, like, you know, toy trucks for little boys. It was fun.